this one to make it even. Yes. And then attach yeah. over here again. So let's use the plates. You can see the feather stem is very resistant. Okay, it's perfect because you need quite a lot of power, quite a lot of uh, sharp plate. So fibers to make a platform for binding. And they give some of these holes. Yeah, so it's done. Now it is time to use the glue again. So, oh, thank you very much. It is really difficult to attach a glue on a feather, but it's easy to attach on a glue on a shark. Please attach a shark. Okay. Please attach a shark. 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 One done. Why I am hurrying? Because it is really hard to make this closer to the fire. The feather will burn, right? Mm. So you should attach it until <laughs> this part. Okay. Yeah. Now it is. Now they are holding feather, right? Yeah. Now they are holding. This uh, connection is very weak. It's very weak. So we need fiber again. We need the fiber again. So please choose long fiber like this. Long fiber like this to attach on a spear. Thank you very much, sir. You have to chew it again. So you can now calculate how much uh, how how much sinew are required of making spear and imagine <coughs> how much amount of sinew you can get with this spear imagine, right? Hmm. you can hunt maybe four animals if you strap this hard then you can get plenty of, plenty of, plenty of sinews so it's a profit because I spent this amount of sinew to get this amount of sinew by hunting if you have water, can you also just dip the sinew in water? Yeah. Is that okay? I mean, That's okay. But actually, the temperature of my mouth, of human mouth, is very good for uh, making glue out from the sinew. So, so the cold stream water, it, not, it doesn't work very well. It works, but not, not very well. Yeah, as you can see, it is now hardened. You touch it. You can feel it is squeezing the shaft. I think the evidence for this atolatl uh, is about uh, 30,000 years old. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. Usually in Europe and Africa, uh, in America, America, actually there is a, there is no evidence of uh, atolatl in Korea too. But it is a real mystery because actually Korean products of points activated during politic area are very excellent for atolatl. But there is no evidence of spiritual Even it is very Locationally close to Siberia, mm -hmm. which use plenty amount of atlatl, but there's no evidence of atlatl in Korea. Japan used this technique as a harpoon to catch some whales, but why not Korea? It's very, <coughs> and very uh, suspicious. You see, sinew is holding here, right? Ah, oh, it sucks really. So, what is atlatl? Uh, atlatl is. Wait, 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 I'm just asking. Ah, really? Ah, so still, okay. Yes, 
जो भी आप देख रहे थे इसी को अटल आटल को अटल 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 अ Okay. I will uh, let's use the last sitting by the most truly. And now it is done. And the last step is to uh, wait till until dry and then add some more glue on it. Okay. And in my uh, I think this is now dry. Okay, it's cool. You can use it in this condition, but also it's better to be sealed. So you can imagine the Pale Paleolithic tribe or family making these spears after the war. Hard work of day daytime. They they just collect around the fireplace and make a glue, making uh, coins, making a spear, and then they of it. You can imagine their lifestyle by doing some experiments like this. You need to add the glue with your hand, like this. This will gonna make your uh, sinew not be uh, what we call it, not be un, not be separated, un unravel. Thank you very much. If you put one person to start, then you add the sinew. Yes. Uh, actually, uh, tying is not required, only binding. <laughs> so, yeah, because it freezes itself. So that even without tar, it's enough? Yeah, yeah, it's enough. But with tar, it will secure more. And this part should be... We need to cover it more. This part is very important. So we don't care if the point is separated inside the animal body. If it fits, it will it, 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 it good, better, because we can make more uh, so wool they're, inside. They're recycled, basically. Yeah, yeah. Basically. But if the feathers are separated, it is really a problem. Like this, I'm not matching. It is hot, it's hot, but you need to see. I'm telling you that woodworking is more difficult than stone. <laughs> if you want, of course, if you want to measure the, the precise like, the value of the tool, you guys should do woodworking the same as the steel or the value of the Maybe. Maybe it's just one. Of yeah, of course. You can use the sprouts of wood, such as acacia. You know, acacia. Acacia has a little sprout, a little stem when when they're young. So that is very good for making. Uh, I made a mistake here. I forgot that this is not been dried yet. Acacia is a. If the seed is not dried, the glue is coming out. So. My mistake. Can you dry it over the fire? Yes. He wants to. He wants to. Uh, 
So, as you can see, the, the attachment of feather is poor because it is not uh, important in spear. And you're making an uh, arrow, it is very important. A spear, just, just, just do it. Never mind. This part is secured, you see, this part is binded, this part is secured more, and... Should not put part at the end? Uh, is it not necessary? Or? It is not necessary. It, it, is, it could be better, but it will uh, increase the weight of the tail, so I just skipped it. So it's fine doing that. So this is a very, very, very primitive way of making an atlas of sphere, as you can see. And uh, where's my spear tool? Oh. It's with this is a pair, right? So you need to make some more spare spears, some more spears, and you hold it together. And imagine you are standing on a hill, and your pack is now running below the hill, such as mammoths or reindeers or rhinos or elephants. And then you can make it like this and then throw it with all together. Actually, I, I will show you later about this in an archery range, yes. but, it's, but I, I will tell you first, it is really hard to aim because it works behind your sight. You see, you throw it, right? Throw it. So it works behind your sight, so it is really hard to aim. That is the reason it is not a, uh, a aiming hunting gear. It is kind of just making a... You need to make a... Like a, some kind of submachine gun, such like it. So, so uh, 20 people, about 20 people running out, and they threw it in one time. Then some spears will be in animals. Yeah, right? So, this is the hunting method with these kind of atlato spears. And I think this is quite <coughs> good for my atlato uh, throwing spear because, as you can see, I can sustain it as horizontally. Right? If the spear was too long or too heavy, it goes like this. It will cause a great shortcoming of distance, right? But now I can sustain it like this. And even hook is maintaining. This means that I can throw it in a straight position. And the help, as you can see, there is a stone weight over here made of slate. This helps me to balance the spear and spearhead. So if the spear is too heavy, this stone pushes down. So we can even move this the position of the stone uh, compared with the uh, the weight of the spear okay so this is the, the physics and kind of skills about prehistoric atlas like this